I'm Dominic Stevens with the Westpac Economics Team. This week we'll chat through the Reserve Bank's latest monetary policy statement and what it could mean for interest rates. So the Reserve Bank adopted a slightly more hawkish tone this morning, signalling an earlier start to OCR hikes. We now expect the first hike will take place in December this year. Now the key change is that although the earthquake has disrupted economic activity in Christchurch, the impact on the rest of the economy has been less severe than expected. If anything, there have been ongoing signs of economic recovery throughout 2011. Now the Reserve Bank remains concerned with the potential inflationary impact of the huge reconstruction task that lies ahead of us in Christchurch. The other big change, and this was more of a surprise from my point of view, is that the Reserve Bank now appears reasonably bullish on the prospects for global growth and New Zealand's export commodity prices. And with that greater optimism for our commodity prices, it looks like the Reserve Bank is a bit more comfortable with the level of the exchange rate. Our market reaction to the Reserve Bank statement was strong. Markets moved to price in the first OCR hike from October this year. That's too early from my point of view, but what it does mean is that floating interest rates could start to move higher within a few months. By contrast, markets are pretty relaxed about the pace of OCR hikes over 2012 and 2013. To me, the risk is that the interest rate hiking cycle is rather steeper than markets are currently pricing. What that means is that I view the two to four year part of the interest rate curve as good value. It could be a reasonable time right now to fix your interest rate rather than stay on floating. Talk to you next week.